Yo, what's going on guys? It's Zombie Slayer here and I'm bringing you guys a quick unboxing of the SoTech adjustable LED RMR site. Now I purchased this off Amazon for 50 bucks. And as you can tell, it is basically a clone of the Trigicon RMR site for your pistols and handguns. Now, as you can see right in the picture, or I mean right on front on the picture, some of these do actually have a SoTech um, labeling on it but I actually received one that doesn't have any branding whatsoever but as you can see you got a little picture of the RMR site on there as well as it says you got a 1913 mount and then you have the Glock mounts included if your firearm needs them and then as you guys can see made in China so this is a $50 site um, off of uh, Amazon $50 optic that's supposed to be a clone of the Trigicon, so we'll see how it is, guys. I'll pop it right open. Comes in a nice little case like a lot of uh, more expensive sites would. So, you know, they're trying to keep it trying to keep it nice. Um, here is the site. It's got a nice little cover on it. We'll leave that for last. When you open it up, right away you have an extra battery. You got the CR2032, which is like your standard optic battery. Most of your... Optics for firearms will use this battery or your key fobs for your car keys. You also got a little cleaning pad, microfiber cleaning cloth up in here. You got the Glock plate right here in case it is needed. That is nice that they give you that option. Also a little silica gel inside keep things nice and dry and then you got the little instruction manual or introduction just says mini reflex or a dot site gives you some quick information that might be handy and then you just got a couple little wrenches up in here for the different uh optic mounts you got a couple little screws in there and then you have a little turn key as well, so you can open up the optic easier and replace the battery if needed. And then last but not least, this is the optic. It'll come with that 1913 little Picatinny mount right on there. And I will actually take it off for you guys on camera. Well, before I do that, I'll pop up, pop off that, and that is the site. Basically, a Trigicon clone. Now, some of them will even go as far and actually say, like, Trigicon on the side. This one does not, and it is made out of uh, metal. It looks like it's, like, aluminum or steel, so it looks like it's actually pretty decent quality. I'm not expecting it, obviously, to be Trigicon quality, but for 50 bucks, the ratings were extremely, extremely good. And people said that this thing was, I'm not going to say up to par with a Trigicon, but it definitely gave it a run for its money for what it cost. So that's what it looks like in the front. And you guys can turn it on with these two buttons. And I'm actually going to remove this 1913 mount right away. And I'll show you what this looks like mounted on my dagger here now i have the gold um glock 19 zafri precision slide for it with the rmr cut so i'm just gonna come just gonna completely take this off like so Looks like there's another bolt. Oh yeah, there's, so then you're gonna need to grab the other set, which is also included. And looks like the top will be needed. Let's screw that. And there we go. Now the battery is exposed. And then here is what it would look like for a quick example with the RMRs on a Glock or a dagger slide. 
or anything else that might fit a micro RMR. Just a quick example of what it'll look like. Now I will remove that for YouTube. And then I actually did just turn on the dot. I'm not sure if you guys are gonna be able to see it on camera. I'll try my best. Oh, there we go. It's kind of hard to get a good angle. There it is. Sorry, that was so difficult. It's still warming up too. I just turned it on. Could take two to one to two minutes to warm up, but you guys have it. You guys can just go ahead and put them screws back in, tighten her up, give it a nice zero. And there is the Trigicon clone off of Amazon for 50 bucks. If you guys enjoyed the video, don't forget to like and subscribe. The channel is almost at 1,000 subscribers. Help me out and let's get there. Thank you guys. Zombie Slayer out.